guys, what's up? How are you doing? How was your Halloween? And what did you become for Halloween? I really want to know. So please tell me in the comments. I'm so curious to know that. And if you thought that because the Halloween is over, we're gonna get rid of those creepy characters, well, you're dead wrong. Cause we're going to do one of them today. Lots of you guys asked me to do some anime character and you know, I'm not a fan, so I haven't watched any. But I, I watched this one and I really like it. So I decided to do it. Death Note. I think the guy name was Ryok or something. So let's get to it. And of course, because we're again doing some kind of latex stuff, I can't talk. Yeah, I gotta shut my mouth and it's gonna be a narration video. Enjoy it and love you. No need to say how much I don't like latex. Get on my dress. So here we go. So first of all, we gotta use some latex because we want to stick the cotton on our face and we can shape it. You can use some water or you can just use latex like me and shape the cotton on your face. You can do this transformation with only painting on your face like in face art, but because we want it to be more natural and you know the cheeks are kind of bulge we have to use some cotton and latex so this is an sfx makeup but you can do it like a face art Ow. my eyes i use some sticky glue as a protection because i don't want to lose any of my eyebrows so we have to do it to cover them and as you see i use cotton and latex all over my face uh, especially above the eyebrows because this part is bulge and we have to use a lot of cotton be very careful guys if latex touches any of your hair or eyebrows you're absolutely gonna lose them okay this is the hard part for speaking so after doing this you probably can't even talk so as you can see we use a lot of cotton above the lips Latex can be really harmful for your eyes, eyebrows, and also your breathing organ. So do not use it a lot and only when it's necessary or, you know, be very careful about that. So here is very important that with the help of latex, you should shape the chin like it's very long. And in here, we're gonna shape the nose like it's short. And you know, I really like his nose, it's really teeny tiny. But this is really hard because here I'm using latex exactly near my eyes. And oh my god, it was so bad. You don't want to try it. You can use bell cap for here, or just like me, use the cheaper option. And only by a cell phone, you can make yourself belt. And because his forehead is longer than mine, then I have to use latex and cotton again on the cell phone. And here we go for the ears. You know, the shape is totally different from a normal human ear, so we have to make it. And again, we have to paint it. It's easy peasy. We're gonna just paint your eyes and around your eyes black. And don't forget about the shadows. As I told you before, the nose is teeny tiny and, you know, it's a little bit sharp. So we have to, you know, just shape it with painting. And by painting these shadows, we can actually, uh, you know, bold the bulge above the eyebrows and also the chains. You know, we're just shaping the things and it's not really something really hard, so I'm sure you can make it. The last part of the face is obviously the mouth. It's big and long and the only thing we have to do is, you know, paint it black. So nothing hard about it. And my favorite part, the teeth. You know, I've made them with paper, so it's easy. The neck and chest should be painted white and, you know, we're gonna just uh, use some dark shadows and you know black aqua color for this part because we want to shape some the veins and these things you know it's not normal we're just following the anime
I've used a toothbrush for spraying some black pigments on my chest and neck, you know, just to make it more natural and scarier. Honestly, the close part was one of the hardest part of this transformation. So, you know, just be very careful about it, that you get the hair right, the clothes, everything. And, you know, it was fun, but hard, but I like it. We gotta get a little haircut here, it's necessary. And about the earrings, don't forget about it, it should be heart shape, anything it can be. The gloves and the ping pong guys, I made them myself. I hope you guys like this transformation because I'm so into it. And here we go. Guys, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, enjoy your life, and enjoy this video. Love you so much, and have a nice day. Bye-bye.